What's up everyone this is Prajot and this is the new Moto G 3rd generation. It has got a 5 inch HD display which is 720 by 1280 just like its predecessors with 294 pixels per inch and has got Corning Gorilla Glass 3 protection. We would have liked a 1080p panel but they had to keep the same price tag. We have got the Qualcomm Snapdragon 410 uh, quad core processor clocked at 1.4 GHz that supports 4G LTE which is a welcome addition. And surprisingly there are two variants of the new Moto G, one with 1GB of RAM and 8GB of onboard storage and the other has 2GB of RAM and 16GB of internal storage. And the price difference in India is just 1000 rupees which is roughly $17 which leads me to the question that who would buy the 1GB variant when there is such a low price difference. And there's a micro SD card slot for storage expansion. There is a 2470 mAh battery which will hopefully perform well considering Motorola's past with batteries. There is a 13 megapixel camera with f2 lens with dual LED flash which is a bump from the 8 megapixel on the last generation Moto G. And the 13 megapixel sensor is the same used on the Nexus 6 and the camera is improved a lot from past generations which were poor in the camera department. And there is now a 5 megapixel selfie snapper which offers a 72 degree field of view. One of the cool features is the new IPX7 water resistance which allows the device to survive under a meter of water for 30 minutes. So taking your phone to the pool is now possible if you are of those sorts. It will be available in white and black color options and there will be 10 different back covers and 5 flip covers available in a variety of colors and materials for customizing your device. Talking about the software, it runs on the latest Android Lollipop 5.1.1 with vanilla Android experience and now has some great software features like Quick Capture which allows you to launch the camera by twisting your wrist twice. You can flick your wrist twice quickly to turn on the flashlight and Moto Display is here on Motorola's budget offering which gives you a preview of notifications without waking your device. The device starts at 11,999 rupees in India and I don't think it offers great value for money. Overall, the new Moto G is a decent phone, but it's not for the Indian market. As there are a lot of phones from Chinese manufacturers and even Motorola's parent company Lenovo which offer great value for money phones for a lesser price. So will you be picking up the new Moto G? Tell me in the comment sections below.